Oh, the big fire. In fact, three Phoenix families have been forced from their homes by a late night fire. It started in one home at the base of South Mountain and spread fast before crews could get things under control. Jose Miguel's live, so those people uh, need to find a new place to stay this morning, Jose. Yeah, unfortunately for them, they do need to find a new place to stay. You can see just how much damage that we're talking about here. There's a huge hole on the roof of that building. That's where the fire originated from. Uh, what we understand is it started behind the building and quickly spread through. When fire crews got here, they found that home fully engulfed, and that's when the fire started spreading to the neighboring home. Six people all together displaced because of this fire. We understand it was a couple and their child, a young couple, and an elderly woman, and it was the elderly woman's home where the fire started and we're told that she was not home at the time that the fire began and we're not even sure if she knows about this fire. Uh, what crews have been able to tell us again is that it started behind the home but that's really all that they know right now. They're not sure exactly how the fire started or uh, why it spread as quickly as it did. We can tell you that they will be back out here a little later on this morning. Uh, they'll check to make sure all of the hot spots are taken care of and they'll also get a better idea of how the fire started, get a, go in for a closer look. There's a lot of damage out here, so it could be some time before they're able to figure out that exact cause. Now, once again, all of those people displaced because of this, but the good news, no one was injured, including firefighters. So again, a lot of people really lucky that they were able to make it out. We'll see you back to you guys. Yeah, Jose, thank you very much.